He's my little brother. He's so little. No, I haven't not. shaved. <laughs> no, he's like a whole foot taller. You are actually almost a whole foot taller than me. When you go grocery shopping, do you have a plan? No. Or a thought process? <laughs> yeah, I mean, there's a, there's a main gist, uh -huh. you know. It's, it's, I try to stick to it, at least if I don't get distracted, right? Okay. Of just meat and veggies at the least. It can be better planned out sometimes, you know. Sometimes yeah. some of the veggies don't go with some of the meat. And I forget about that, but... Okay. Smoothies. Yeah. How many bananas do you like to eat in a week? I could eat like one or two a day. I like to grab like a few that are more green uh -huh. and then I'll grab another oh, group that are riper. First, yep, yep. Those look good. Right? Oh, when you were little, you liked to eat honey. Just yeah, like a straight up tablespoon of honey. honey. Well, what do you want to mainly use it for? Is honey good with oatmeal? Oh, yeah, yeah, honey's great with oatmeal. I like drinking tea. You don't need it to be like yeah. special, you know? Yeah, it doesn't need to be special. So we're gonna get honey. Let's get That's almond right. milk. I like adding them to the shakes. The shakes. Than, like water or something, yeah. Do you have plenty of fridge space or is it so-so? Okay, yeah. then that almond milk would be best for you to get. The Tetra Pack carton ones. Yeah. Because yeah. these aren't be refrigerated. You don't have to, until you open it. Yeah. Yeah. That was a big thing I liked about it. Get a couple, especially if you're gonna. Oh, yeah. Yes, perfect. Cool. I like eating oatmeal a lot. Okay, so you don't eat breakfast, but you like oatmeal from time to time. I do. Rolled oats. But we've kind of covered breakfast. You have good fiber and fruits. You have the oatmeal. And then you have the protein powder at home to make it balanced. Okay, so next let's move on to like lunches and dinners. Hello. So Hi. you like salmon? Yes. Let's get salmon first. Okay. All right. Salmon everywhere now is like the same price per unit pound. This one has a higher fat content, but this one does have a higher protein content than um, Atlantic. I like getting both, it doesn't matter, but I like Atlantic because it's really like fatty and nice. I think I normally get Atlantic. Yeah, okay. Like this normally I get for like, I feel like I end up getting these more on occasion. Grab one that you like, or you can grab a couple, perfect. What's another protein that you like? You know, I do like, actually I like pork a lot. Okay. I feel like pork's a good middle because I, I yeah. like beef a lot, but I know I'm kind of straight from red meat a little. Chicken, okay. I need a little more practice with. So chicken okay. or pork. Okay. Yeah. We can get like pork tenderloins because they're a leaner cut. Okay, yeah. let's get it. We keep leaving the cart behind because it's so crowded. Pick a pork, any pork. That one's bone in. Uh, usually I try to go for the boneless because yes. it's, you know, it's less work. Since you don't cook it that often, let's just get one for yeah. now. So now that we have these, let's think of like two to three veggies that we can pair with the salmon and with the pork. So for me, uh -huh. a really universal one uh -huh. is like broccoli. Yes, broccoli. Then I can eat broccoli with any. Normally I make it uh, specifically just like quickly uh, blanched. Yes, blanched. Yeah. <laughs> I think it's a little bit of a Crunchiness, Florence. Florence. Very nice. You know what you like with salmon? Yes. So with the pork. Yeah, that one I'm not sure. I, I figured I would just. Salt and pepper. Salt and pepper. Yeah. Salt and pepper. Yeah. You can turn it into stir fry with broccoli. Oh, yeah. You can chop it like yeah, all good. small, and then yeah. you can combine it with broccoli That's good. and ginger. Oh yeah. You can do yeah. broccoli, ginger, garlic, and. Um, Maybe almost like a sweet, like maybe soy, and then a bit of brown sugar. Yeah, that works. Yeah. Do you like shrimp? I love shrimp, yeah. Okay, shrimp is great because it's like very quick protein and it, it defrosts really fast. That's true. In warm water. Yeah, okay. they're like so small. I prefer this one because I like the taste, but you don't have to, uh -huh. so it depends on what you want to get. Okay. Do you want to get one or? Yeah, I could get one. Okay. You know, my main thing is huh. it not having us any more skin. Yeah, this one that's, does have Yeah, skin. that's my main thing. Shim. I just like having this because uh -huh. it's very convenient, yeah, yeah, especially yeah. if you're um, low on time with work. Yeah. And then you can combine it with your chopped up pork and chicken or shrimp. Then there's one that already has chicken. I like getting the vegetable one just because I like to use whatever protein I want. Yeah. So do you want to grab like a couple? I'll yeah, I'll go yeah. with you. Yeah, I'd rather just get the, just the veggies. Just the veggies. What do you like drinking tea for? Is it for oh, like yeah. the caffeine or? Not the caffeine. The taste? Sometimes it's nice to have something hot. So I'm thinking maybe like a ginger tea and then something just for like... Yeah. Just, you know, to okay. have a nice tea. Yeah, how about do this one? This one. 
that's caffeine free and then you could do decaf green tea Decaffeine. yeah because you don't really care about caffeine yeah no i specifically okay. try not to take caffeine. nice pit stop at another store great for protein and probiotics look at this big foot it's been dog. spotted <laughs> okay Okay, so, so far we have grocery shopped at um, Trader Joe's. How did you feel with the plan that we had? It's nice, it's, it's, it's grocery I'm store. always, um, I'm always excited after I go shopping, you know. Cause it's like, really? You know, it's food to me. Yeah! Plus food's nice. No, know? I get really excited. I get excited get... for food, you know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I just don't know. You can also get frozen foods so mm. that you're more prepared. Mm -hmm. There's something that I don't like online in the whole health space. Yeah. It's kind of polarizing where people are like, you shouldn't have this because it's processed and it's frozen and it's not healthy. But realistically, for some people, you gotta have something to yeah, for some people. To. And especially if like, you know, I gotta have stuff at home if, because the, the way my schedule's laid out since I go so early to work, I'm sleeping yeah. most of the like, afternoon yeah you know, afternoon to night and then when i wake up most things yeah. are closed things that are open are fast food places and i don't want yeah. i don't work at 4 a.m so you know there's many times where i'll wake up anytime yeah. from like 10 p.m to midnight yeah. stop number two rapid yeah, but... <gasps> there it is i feel like we do have the same rice bowl beliefs because like you don't want to eat from this all the time yeah like but it's I'm just well aware that it's you know what i mean there's a point of convenience for being busy yeah. the thing is sometimes yeah. i'm just hungry and i go straight to preparing the food and yeah. i'm like oh, i've got to have to make right it's just more of those emergency situations yeah you're well, not eating that every single day i'm gonna get one of these okay yeah get it there's some of these too because you like Teriyaki's good. Yeah, because yeah, you can cook everything all at once. Yeah. Oh no, the cart is oh. going away. Oh my god. <laughs> this is 1.97. This is close enough. Okay, perfect. It's nice to get like a fun meat. Yeah. Perfect. And then you can also cook everything all at once with these marinated meats. Yeah. And then just store them away and reheat it's them. It's nice. I don't really need to season them. Usually, yeah. So. It's quick. I had the last Yeah, time. you like those? Okay. I had this the last yeah, time. Oh, they're so good. What do you like about these? I don't know. Something about them is just, you know what it is? It reminds me of eating a Korean barbecue. Mm, that's, that's, yes. That's, that's really it. It's yeah. I like. Right. I like them. They're just so good. Bean sprouts. Yep. And spinach. We're definitely like very blessed to have this. Oh yeah. Um, most, usually most of the time, you know, other other kinds of food are more flavorful. Get this one. I've never had that before. It looks good. But yeah. I feel like I've never had it. It's like sweeter. Uh -huh. You condone the killing of this when you buy these. <laughs> Not the radish spirit. <laughs> Getting some stir fried fish cake. What do you like about kimchi? I think it was like one of my first memorable like exposures to trying yes. other things. I wasn't very open minded too much about a lot yeah. of other foods. And I think kimchi was one of the first foods. It was your entry. That's yeah. funny because mom introduced me to kimchi. When I first tasted it, I was like, <gasps> and then she was like, a lot of people are really appreciative of this. <laughs> and then I was like, that's, you're yeah. right. Something about it was interesting to me. Yeah. I was just like, oh, this is pretty You're like, like, oh, it's a different flavor yeah, like, profile. I think that's the key to being more adventurous with your food is just being open-minded and yeah. trying uh, That's why I things. feel like I'm not very picky. Because a lot of food usually has something interesting about you it. You used to be picky though. <laughs> yeah. yeah. But I think because you were more willing and open. Yeah, a lot, a lot of food has something. Usually there's right. something about it that yeah. I really enjoy, so... Damn. Ted Talk. It's not ginger. For, for one thing, <laughs> one of the... video game, there was, uh, it's airborne as well. Uh, there oh, spores. okay. Spores, though, specifically. Because it's a, spores. It's, a, it's, a, it's a fungus. We are now home. The chance bullet. Sure. bite of this because I'm tempted to. Okay. The seasoned salted squid and then the radish. Do you want to try the radish first? Sure. It's good, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah. No, okay, let's try it's the like squid. It's a not spicy kimchi. Mm-hmm. Mm. Oh, that's good. The squid's good. Is red stuff squid? 
Huh? These bread stuff? Mm-hmm. And squid? Mixed seasoned squid. Mm. Oh, I didn't realize it was eight bucks. Oh, well. <laughs> it's so good. Good work. Goodbye, everybody.